Hey, what's going on? This is Earthcat Mushrooms coming back with another video. Today we're gonna make a liquid culture syringe out of colonized grain spawn. And if you find this video helpful, please leave us a like, uh, subscribe, and uh, hopefully leave us a comment and uh, if you have any questions. So just like everything on this channel, super simple. All we need is a syringe needle. We need a grain jar that's fully colonized. You can see fully colonized here. And we need a liquid medium. In this case, I have uh, a jar of liquid uh, sanit um, It's just water, malt extract, and I sanitize it in a pressure cooker for 30 minutes. So you can see it's a little bit uh, discolored here. That's from the malt extract. Uh, some of the sugars uh, caramelize a little bit in the pressure cooker. It turns it just a little bit off color here. Not to worry about that. That just gives what this is the what this is going to do is give your mycelium something to eat. You can use just sanitized water, but if you do that, you'll need to use that liquid culture syringe within the uh, couple days because they won't have anything to eat. So let me put this. Uh, we're gonna put the syringe together here. And then we're gonna pull out uh, a whole 10 cc's of the liquid culture. Just fill your syringe up all the way. And then inject that straight into your grain spot. Put the cover back on here. We're gonna use this back in just a minute. Now for this, just give it a uh, give it a turn a few times, give it a little shake. What that's gonna do is release some of the mycelium here, and then we'll tilt it. And what you can see is you'll there's gonna be liquid that's coming down, and we're gonna suck all that up. I can see some floating on top right now, which is perfect. That's what we need. So we'll put our syringe back in. Flip it over and we're gonna suck all this liquid up as much as we can here. Now if there's a little bit left over, shouldn't be a big deal. Hard to get it all out sometimes. I got just about all of it, which is good. And now, what we have is a liquid culture syringe. Now there's, you can't see it, there's a little bit of floaty right here and there. Uh, if you let this sit for a couple days, uh, it's gonna start growing in here though, but uh, really, the, the mycelium is in here. You can use this right away. Uh, what you can do with this is you can uh, put it on auger plates, make sure your, col your colony is um, uh, no contamination there if you like. You can put it right into a liquid culture in bulk or you can just inoculate something with it. And it may take a little bit uh, longer since this, this isn't completely developed, uh, but this is a good, good way to get a liquid culture syringe uh, out of some grain spawn. Now why would you need this? There's a few different instances. Sometimes there's some there are some mushrooms that actually don't produce spores. So that would be one instance I can think of. Another one would be if you used your all your liquid culture syringe, and um, and then you got some kind of contamination. Um, then you have your jar that's not contaminated, and you can pull off some mycelium and make a new culture syringe and basically start over. So really good applications for it. Um, there's a ton more that that you, I'm sure you can think of as well, but a great way to um, get a culture syringe if you did something wrong or uh, a few different ways, you know, a few other things. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, uh, leave us a like. Hope you subscribe. Uh, if you have any questions, leave some comments below and we'll catch you in the next video. Have a good one.